let us expand and simplify this expression we got three brackets so expand this you can't expand three brackets uh, all at one time so first I'm going to expand these two brackets and then I'll expand with this bracket okay so I'll write 2x plus 5 as it is and now it expand with x times x which gives me x squared I'm using the foil method so first then outside x times minus 2 is minus 2x then the inside that is minus 3 times x is minus 3x and l for last minus 3 times minus 2 is plus 6 okay so this is x squared plus 5 now I have to simplify this too this can be simplified plus 2x my sorry minus 2x minus 3x gives you minus 5x so it's x squared minus 5x plus 6 now you don't have an acronym for this here to do the next step I would do like this this is always safe to do like this so 2x minus this whole bracket sorry 2x times this whole bracket x squared minus 5x plus 6 it's always good to be safe okay because you can do directly but uh, students tend to do lots of mistake at this step at this step so I prefer that you do this step now you're opening you're multiplying 2x with x squared which is 2x cubed then 2x times minus 5 is minus 10x squared plus 2x times 6 is plus 12x now 5 times x squared is 5x squared I'll not write 5x squared here I'll write plus 5x squared here so I hope you understand what I'm doing then 5 times minus 5x is minus 10x and 5 times minus sorry 5 times plus 6 is plus 30 so I have lined up the like terms so this is my next example so I'll drag that away from I don't want to see that now so let me drag that away I don't want you now okay so don't disturb me so this is equal to 2x cubed uh, minus 5x squared plus 2x you have to be very ca uh, very careful with the signs and this is your answer and as as always I like to check my answer I'll use the graphic calculator in a subtle way in a cunning way to check my answer so the question is 2x so this is my question so I'll keep this both inside okay so and get my calculator out so let me move the calculator go to your table menu okay you should have your calculator so first type in this the question in y1 which is 2x plus 5 times x minus 3 times x minus 2 just like that and the answer in the y2 or in y2 so you go to x raised to 3 if you have see, seen my previous video I've shown you how to check this in factorization so the same thing can be done for expansion plus 30 plus 30 30 okay and then go to set 1 to 5 is fine and see look at the, look up the table uh, I have done some mistake uh, these are not are uh, have I typed in rightly 2x cubed minus 5x squared plus 2x uh, plus 30 that's right okay so let me go and check uh, 2x plus 5 x minus 3 times so I've done some mistake so let's find the mistake okay it's always good to check the answers so what mistake have we done x squared minus 2x minus 3x plus 6 this is fine 2x cubed minus 10x plus 12x 5x squared 
yeah see can you see the mistake this is always good to check okay so this is a good exercise for me too five times minus 5x should be minus 25x okay so can you see the usefulness of this method okay so this though it's cunning it's always good you can end up doing uh, silly mistakes as I did so I'm also a student so let me so this should be your answer so execute and here I should change this into see I could find my mistake so delete uh, delete and I'm going to put here minus 13 X okay I was a bit confident so that that's what happens when you're too confident so exit and table and here we go it's exact 14 14 so your expansion is perfect okay you should be proud about it and you can give yourself a smiley face as you could find your correct yourself okay moving on to the next question let's look at this question yeah change of color blue now <clears throat> this is similar but here you've got 2x plus 7 squared so I'll write like this this is 5x times 2x plus 7 times 2x plus 7 okay and now you can expand this and uh, then expand with 5x or I'll expand this first I'll, exp um, I'll multiply this with both of them so this is nothing but 10 x squared plus 35 x I will be super careful this time I don't want to do mistakes okay but if I make mistake I can always check my answer now using the foil method first term 10 x squared times 2 x is 20 x cube then 10 x squared plus 7 is 70 x squared then you got this again this is 35 times 35 x times 2 x is again 70 x squared plus 35 times 7 okay use my calculator not my brain 35 times 7 I don't know which is 245 plus 245 x is the answer okay no you have to simply you can simplify this you can simplify 70x squared plus 70x squared is uh, 140x squared plus 140x squared plus 245x. That's what I claim to be the answer, but I want to check my answer. I'm not quite confident about myself after the horrible mistake that I did. Okay, so let me see my question so go to menu and go to table okay delete yes delete yes so the first you type in the equation the question 5x bracket 2x plus 7 squared just like that and in this you type in 20x cube plus 140x squared plus 245x plus 245x and then go to table here we go all both the values are exact so you should be proud of yourself and you can give yourself five stars why should you be miserly see you in the next video